Hello procrastinators and welcome to Nerdcubes 101. Today we will be looking at Chuck's Allinge 3D. As it says in the corner, that is Chuck's Allinge. Chuck's Allinge. I know what it's supposed to be, but shut up. Uh, this is a game that appeared on Steam, and it seems to be sort of a remake of Chips Challenge, that old top-down game that came in the Microsoft Game Pack that had Ski Free and the one with the mice you had to grab cheese and push blocks and also the one where you had to put the line and it grew and you had to not hit the balls, whatever that was. Um, exceptional World Pack of Games. So this appears to be a remake of Chips Challenge, sort of. It's got all new characters and stuff, but it's it's got sort of the feel and the soul of it. Um, let's just have a quick go into it. It's sort of a puzzle game. Unlike Chips Challenge, this isn't turn-based. So in the other one, everybody would move when you moved. So everything happened. This is a bit more real-time, even though it's still assigned to a grid. Uh, so there's five sets of levels, and each set of levels has uh, 25 levels. So that means there are 754 levels. Uh, in fact, there's a level editor, so technically there's infinite. They always say there's a level editor, so there's infinite levels. Well, there's a finite amount of items, so there's a finite amount of levels. Um, so, uh, basically, you have to solve the puzzles. That's a talky thing. Oh god, I don't care about the talky things. There's some talky bits you can do. There's also go back in time you can do by pushing backspace. Uh, this thing here that I'm pushing needs me to gather all the other blue things to be able to, um... Uh, open it. It will open up if I gather all the other blue things. If you push a, a block into the water, it will become something you can stand on. Otherwise, you drown and have to do a backspace. Uh, that is a pole that won't go down, so I need to work out how to get that down. Or just how to get round it. Um, so, I have really cocked this up to get all them. Yeah, so it's a little puzzle game. Uh, it's assigned to grids. Huh, how the frack am I supposed to get this one? There's a tentacruel under the water. Uh... Hang on, let's go back. Back, back, back. Faster, 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 faster. Pull them out. Pull them all out. The time still ticks on, and everything's based on time, so uh, there's no punishment for going back in time. Uh, right, so if I push two in... Oh, that's what you're supposed to do. If you push two in, then you get to grab those. Oh, crap. Fucked you up. Uh, so then you push two in here. Oh, hang on. No, this isn't going to work either. Push two in here, and you get to grab those. But then I've just got to push two in here. Oh, hang on. Oh, I love this. I love puzzle games. Whoops, one too far. It's basically all the slidey block puzzles ever. Huh. Then I need two more to get to that guy. Oh, I've seen what it is. Never mind me. Never mind my idiocy. Right, pull you back up there. And then pull you up to there. That'll do. What I need to do is push that down there. And then shove it down there. And I can grab it. And then do the same with the other one. I worked it out. I worked it out. Right. Oh, that's wrong. <laughs> I worked it out just not very well. Uh, shove you in there like that, and then you up there like that. Grab that, that thing opens, and then I can get to the exit. Hooray! I have solved the level! Purple Sonic the Hedgehog is pleased. Next! We should go to the next level. The level's pulled up quite nicely. And we're here, so that's something that needs a key and a block. That's a little thing that's running around like a loon. If we stand on these things, we zoom off. You can step off of them any time. Uh, okay, right. We're gonna try and dodge all these horrific monsters. Whoop, dodge. And now we've got to dodge these terrific monsters. Nice. Whoops. Nearly fell off. You can't go back against them unless you have some sort of go back against them device. Down and off. The down and off. And I might be out. Unlock it from here. Unlock. Nice. So some levels are tricky puzzle things. Some of them are slightly dodging monstersy things. Uh, and overall, it's genuinely captured the feel of it quite nicely. Hang on. Step on that to lower that thing. Okay. Hmm. That goes back up. I need a block. How do I get a block out from here? Well, I push that one there. 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 And I've utterly cocked that up. Yeah, completely cocked that up. Back, 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 back. Uh, if I push this one down here and then one out here, that'll help. And then one along there like that. But then I need to break back into here. How would I do that? Can't push two at a time. Some things you can push two at a time off, not these. Uh, da -da 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 -da. I should have done levels like I knew, so I look like a super genius. <laughs> uh, right. No, there's no pulling of blocks or anything. But it's against the rules. Maybe it's not that. Maybe I've got to push it out from a different place. How would I get a block out of if that was an enclosed area? I would do that, and then I would do that, and then I would do that, and then I would do that. Okay. Uh, so that would get us a block out. If I do that the other way around, so if I push. Oh, hang on. I need you pull back in. Push you out, push you out, and then I push. Nope, not that way. You go that way, so you go that way, and then push you down. No, that makes it even worse. Damn it! 
<laughs> I can never visualize these bloody things until I do it. Uh, if I push, oh, if I push that one down, and then over, and then that one down and over, and then that one over. Oh, that's how you do it. Oh, okay. And then that goes down there like that. Now I need to get back. Oh, now I need to get back past. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Uh, there's no way to break them up. I pushed them in too close. Hang on. I pushed that one in. Back, 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 back. I pushed them in too far. Oh, no. I need that one pushed down, though. I need that one to be over there. <sighs> Ooh, puzzle. You're tricky. Uh, hmm. <laughs> if I go, no, I'm, I'm just, I'm doing the same thing. I hate puzzle games like this. You're always just doing the same bloody thing. Push you over there, push you over there, push you over there. Done. Done what? I don't know. <laughs> no, come on, come on, come on, come on. Think, think, think with your brain. Think with your brain. Two minutes so far. Step on that thing and that goes down. So I need to get past and also squash the things. Okay. Thinky. Think this is medium difficulty puzzles. Medium difficulty. Uh. My only real concern so far, or not concern, the only real thing I want to say is that the puzzles do skew slightly bizarre. The, 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 the difficulty level does spike quite bizarrely sometimes. Um, so you do get like bizarrely hard levels like this. It might just be that I'm stupid. So that's definitely got to go down there like that. And I just need to move you out of the way. If I move you there, I can't get past in any way whatsoever. So that doesn't work. I need you to budge over to the left. If there are a point during this where I can get to the left and budge that one over first... Uh, stop looking around. Um, if I budge you... Up. Oh, no. No, 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 no. If I budge you in, and then budge you down... Oh, no, I can't get past. No, oh, arse trumpets. Okay. If I don't budge you in... I need to budge you in all the way. Oh, my God. Video games are hard. Uh, you over there, you over there, and then... That's just completely little locked away. Back. God damn it. I will not give up. Uh, right. This one's really flummoxed me. I don't know why. Might be because it's four in the morning, but... What do we... How do we... Who do we... What is this? Right. We need a block. Specifically that block, maybe. We can't get past it unless we do a... Push it out of the way, which we can't do. So we got to... We got to shove that one in to get it out of the way. Is the best step. We push that one down. Let's get that down. And then we got to get these ones out of the way. But if I do that, now that one is in the way, and that's already locked on the left there, so I can't get past it. So... We don't push that one down. And how do we get past here? We push a different one down, possibly. Can we try it with pushing this one? Uh, no, hang on. Don't go up, don't go up, don't go up. Oh, hang on, that's an idea. If I push that one over there... Can I get rid of them by going shove and shove? Oh, that's how you do it. That's the way around. I knew I'd get it in the end. I, I hope to the YouTube gods I would get it in the end. Still on this, and it's a teleporter. I appear here, and I've done it. Yeah! Okay, that only took fucking 20 minutes. Uh, let's have another... Oh, what is this one? Right, so when you step on one of these, step off, it breaks away. So you've got to work out your path before you do anything. Uh, we need to... Oh, hang on. Let's not Let's not do this yet. You need to get... Oh, I need to go through it and get all of these. And then... Oh, knack of that. And then I need to go up here, grab that key, and then get all the way back to one of these. So that wasn't too hard. You see, some of them you'll be like, oh, that's the solution. And other ones you're like, but I don't know. I'm going to be here for a week. Ooh, slidey puzzles. Um, Like in the old... Um, I was about to say Sonic game, the old Pokemon game. You get slidey puzzles. In fact, this game, Chip Challenge, I assume, came way before Pokemon. But we did bounce. I got killed. Okay, right, that's how that happens. So we need to go and get, um... I don't know. I can't see what that'll be. There's a rock there. I don't know what that rock does. Let's push you out of the way. Uh, ooh, hang on, careful. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh, 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 I see it. Okay. What's happening here is, as you can see in the top left, what I thought was a weird webcam icon is actually how many are left. So they're actually hidden. Look. Ah ha ha. So when I push them out of the way... Wah -ha. Uh, smash. Oh, I thought I could smash the rock or something. When I push them out of the way, it's going down one. So that's me grabbing some uh, of these things. So I've moved the blue one. I need to move the red one. How do I get to the red one? I need to move the green one. I can move the green one by doing that and then getting off very quickly. Uh, the yellow one... If I do it that way around, and then... Oh, no, that's going to kill me. Uh, down. Okay, and then over, and then... Oh, no, 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 I really can't go back that way. Uh, if I can budge that, budge that, go back, die. 
I can't go up. Oh, maybe I can go up and then budget down. Okay, that's how we get past that one. To get the... Uh, I hope I don't need that for anything. I don't need that for anything, do I? No, I need to go that one there to get that one there to get that one there. Oh, no, see, see, I've still got the problem of I've got to go back. I've got no way of getting back if I do it that way. Okay, no, that doesn't work. Um, I can grab that one like that. If I go over here... Let's get rid of the blue one quickly. Blue one. Woo! Woo! Red one. Nice. Uh, now I just need... I could... Oh, crap. Oh, no, 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 no. Go down here. <laughs> so it's a difficult little puzzle game. Uh, right, hang on. What was I... I can't remember what ones I have now. I've got the red one. I've got the blue one. I need to get the green and the yellow like that. Oh, no, not the yellow. There's another one. There's, is there one under the rock? Put one under the bleeding rock. Oh, you can push the rice here in the rock. There's a fixture. Oh, what a numpty am I. Right, down there, down there, down there. Okay, never mind. Never mind, I thought the rock was solid. Uh, right, let's do one and not cock it up this time. Oh, Jesus. All right, sure that... Um, I see the path I'm supposed to take. Let's see if I can get this right. No, 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 I've cocked it. I've cocked that up. Because I've got to go up here, not back to where I was starting from. Okay. But we've learnt a lesson. We've learnt that I should have grabbed that one on the way back. If I can get that one on the way past, I should be golden. Oh, but I need to get that one as well. Okay, so I need another whip set on here, like this. Let's go like that on. That's the way. Aha, uh -huh, aha. Uh -huh. Get up here, grab, 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 grab. Boop, 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 boop. Yeah! I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I thought I said 35 minutes. You did that 35 minutes for that level. Uh, when you start moving, the creatures start moving. Some of them bounce around the place and gradually get further. And other ones um, just sort of follow patterns and paths. Every, every creature has a pattern and path. Whoops. Whoops again. Uh, so you've got to work out uh, how you're going to be dealing with them. Bounce. Bounce. Dodge your friend. Go. Nice. And we're done. So yeah, all the creatures, I think. Unlike the last game. In, uh, I say the last game. is a completely different thing, I assume. But Chip's challenge was every time you moved, then the monsters would move. They all had their patterns and stuff, but it was turn-based. You could sit and wait. And there was one level where you had, like, sort of an enclosed area, and there were, like, hundreds of enemies around it. And you had to be very, very, very careful. Uh, no, right. If we put you down there like that, and then put you up there. We're pushing you down. We want to get you... Uh, if I push you over there, then we did. Unless some of these are dissolving walls. They are not. So other walls do break away and dissolve. Um, but I haven't worked out which one specifically. It does seem to be almost random. Hang on, let's go back, let's go back. I need to get past. How do I get past? Uh, so that was, say they're all going to the ones that's closest to them. This one has to be pushed down. So this one has to be pushed all the way to the right, which will lock it away. So I can't do that. So this opening is wrong. I need to get that one. Hang on, does that one start out of the way? That one starts out of the way, so we've got to do those ones later. So we're going to do them in reverse order, uh, is the plan. That one has to be pushed down. Okie dokie, right. So then this one has to be pushed. Uh, we'll swap these two. Can I swap these two around? If I push that one down and over. Yes, we'll swap these two around. So I'll push you over there like that, and then up here. And I'll go around and push this one down. And then this one... I can push up you down and now this one's gone so I can go round. I can grab it from the other side, give it a shove up and over and then I can go back round. There we go. Nice and simple. See some of them you just there going yeah this is five seconds and other ones you just there staring at it for three days not knowing anything. Oh this one looks like joyous occasions. What happens if I go on? Oh it's all moving. Oh it's all moving. Okay if you jab the ice can I jab the ice onto other planes? I don't think I can actually. Go! Oh no it can just kill you. Okie dokie, right. Careful, squeaky chair. Uh, we're going to go down, and then we're going to drop off now. Nope, drop off now. Oh, I have to hold it a little bit more. There we go. Whoop, up. Grab that one. Then grab that one. Go up one. Grab that one. Grab that one, and then go to the end. Nice, simple, easy. Uh, if you push the ice into lava, it will melt it away, the lava away, and it will just become water. If you push the ice into water, it will freeze. Uh, I now need to get at the very least three here. Is there a way of doing it in two? No, there is only a way of doing it in three. So I have to be careful of how I push them away. Uh, over there like that, and there's my three. Okay, that was simple. That was a nice, simple, easy one. Whoop. Uh, I just got to push them in the right place, like that. 
and then this last guy over and up. Oh, oh, I love pushy block puzzles. I don't know why. I don't like the ones where, like a pushy block puzzle I'm fine with because you can work it out. The ones I don't like are the ones that you have, um, you get those like, sort of like square grids and there's one missing, you have to slide it along and budget around. You get them and then it makes a shape at the end or a face or something. I hate those bloody things. Ooh, cherries. Ooh, bombs. Okay, right, so that's a cherry. Uh, oh, okay, so this is a little arrow system that we have. Hang on. So these things here get controlled by stepping on this in a certain direction. Um, so now, oh, he's exploded, but that's... Oh, no, I need both of them to survive. Hang on. I need you to go... I can't get you to go down at that point, can I? And I can't get you to go down at that point, can I? Um, hmm, interesting. So I need two to be able to destroy this. So I need to dodge all of these and destroy these two. Hang on, let's go right back to the start. Do you start off evenly? I cannot remember for the life of me. Ah, you do. Right, okay. So go down there like that and then get you over. Don't run into that because that's a stupid maneuver. Then down. Then over. And then see now they've got, they don't have separate spaces. I can't touch them or anything because I'll die. So if you go over, you'll explode. And I have nowhere for you to go. Hmm, interesting. Very, very interesting. Uh, down. No, so, so the first thing they have to do is go down. Run down, and then, oh, not left, down. Now that guy has to go to the right, has to, because otherwise he explodes. Now at this point they can both go down. Oh no, at this point I can shove that guy up one. Ahahaha, <laughs> that's what, that's the little, that's the bastard right there. Put you over there like that, put you up, so he can sit in there and I don't have to worry about him until now. Okie dokie, that's the little trick. I saw it, I saw it good. Right, okay, so yeah, that's the sort of level you have to think at. It's, it gives you an impossible situation, which is what the old chip challenge would do. It's not an old chip, this isn't a sequel. This is, I don't think it's a sequel, it's, it's just something that feels a lot like it. It will give you an impossible challenge, and you have to work out how to make that impossible challenge possible. Uh, every time you step on one of these, these things will go until they stop. Mm, right, they'll go until they hit a wall or something. Uh, pretty nice empty path going along there like that. I'll grab that, put you out the way. Put you out of the way and then go. Whee! Nice and smooth. We'll do one more level. Uh, and it will... It does actually rank you in the world every time you finish it, which makes me always feel guilty. Oh my god! What is that? Okay, every time that hits... Oh, that we got freezy bits. Ah, okay, I can't push this one anymore because you can see those little hexagons there. Or whatever they are on the in the water. That just says that that's the edge of the world. So I, basically, in this level, I'm racing that little dick. Ah, no, you see? Oh, no. Oh, look, see, there's a corner. There's a little corner edge in there, so I can slide along the ice without putting myself in the water. So I'm just... This is just a rush level. Stop it, you bastard. I forget to murder him at the end of this. And then up, and then round, and then go, and then I'm a little bit quicker than him. So normally this would be turn-based, so it would be set up as a puzzle. So this, this game is a little bit more of a focus on the skill uh, than the previous thing. Oh, look at him stop. It's like... What happens if, if that's like looks like kid of Mike Wazowski from Monsters Inc. If he had a kid, it would look like that. If he'd have to have someone with several eyes. Anyway, enough to average out four, you know, so at least eight. Uh, anyway, thank you very much for watching. That was Chuck's challenge. It's on Steam, etc. So yeah, Terra. Enter the domain of the nerd cube. Videos dropping from above like bird poop. Enter the domain of the nerd cube. Videos dropping from above like bird poop.